All right, you guys. So it actually been a little bit of time since I kept you informed and tuned to everything that's been going on. And clearly it's been a whole lot, a whole lot of, um, I believe the last time that you guys seen me, I was trying to set up this room. Hold on one second phone call. All right. So sorry about that. I had a phone call. But last time we guys spoke, I was probably getting my life together in the new girl's room. So a lot has happened because David had took initiative to kind of organize their room type of thing. And he kind of put a lot of stuff in areas. <sighs> It's been really stressful, you guys, because I'm trying to move around the house, trying to clean up the house, but we're also in a crunch for the baby shower, which, which probably will be over about the time um, you guys actually see this video. But it's so hard to decorate for Christmas, a baby shower, and move a house. So um, I thought I should chime in since I'm working on some stuff now. So let me show you the update on what things are looking like. Coming into the room, Stuff is still not in place, but I want to show you the progression. So this room is probably looking a lot different from when you guys have last seen it. So David have put the floor mats that was in the other room. If you have remember from the other video, this is the same floor mat. We have put the day bed in here and that's pretty much what it's looking like. That's what you guys last seen. But clearly all her toys have been in here. She has been playing and all that type of stuff. But the plan is to get all this stuff organized. And the stuff that she's not really using. Get in that area. <laughs> and push it over there and kind of out of the way type thing. Yesterday I did end up going to Home Good and get in this curtains. This is a double blackout. It has beads on it. It's so pretty. And the camera's not really doing justice. But you see these beads on it? So it's like a double layer type of effect. And I could do like this. And kind of have it like that. And tie it up type thing. But it is so pretty. I was just putting this up now to see what that looks like. This is the other one. That's just what the back looks like. So this bed is just kind of like crazy right now. But if you're interested in this, this is what the name is of this brand. It's Christian Starantino, New York. And it was just $40. So also, nothing has changed is I have gotten another one of these cubicle things. This is what used to be in her closet. And I decided to get another one to match the size of the TV so that I can pretty much use one for um, new baby and this one for Nala. So generally we put all her knickknacks in here, socks, hats, clothes that are coming up to wear but not quite there yet. Just, I just find places for stuff. So I am also in the midst of getting more of these cubicle things uh they're actually in this bag right here so i do plan in this video to kind of get that together and labeled and all that other stuff we did bring in the changing table in here and also i seen this on somebody else's video where they hung bows off of this ikea rack this is the center center easter rack and they just have little um but little hooks that just pops on pops off or you just um do that type of thing this is not organized how i would want this to look because i do want them to be like kind of color coded and darks with darks light is white but david is the one that did that so i let him be great but i need another rack i am debating if i want to keep this in here or if I want to put this on the other side of this wall in their bathroom. Uh, because I do need a place to put Nala's name. Oh, it's, is it backwards? Yep. Nala's name. So I don't know how I want to do that. And then if I put Nala's name up, I need to get one for a new baby. But we don't have a name for her. So 
to be continued. Also, I did end up getting this off of Marketplace the other day, which I thought was super cute, uh, which is this little princess mirror. And I know I wanted to stay away from this princessy type of look, pinks and all that, but I'm having two girls and somehow my life is getting there. So uh, the plan is to put this, oh, I guess you can't see that, but put it right there in the middle. I'm going to go ahead and get these cubbies going. And once I can get that going, I can get a little bit more on it. So. I think for now what I might do is put some of the toys in some of these bins because I don't have a lot of places for everything because we don't have a bunch of stuff for new babies even though we need to get it out of the closet. So these are the bins that we got from Target. It is the Room Essentials one. And these little clips, these things are expensive, but they're cheap, but they're expensive, child. They're $3.99 a pack, and the bins are $5.99 a pack, which is kind of expensive. But because I already had these ones, I didn't want to get different types of bins. So I just got the same ones, but I really wanted to end up getting the Amazon ones. I was really close to doing that, but I didn't. It looks like I'm taking a break because Nala needs some attention. Don't you? Don't you, girl? She she's up now. I don't think I showed that part. Yeah, she's up now. Look at her. I don't right, have the remote. Let me ask you a question. You said the comment that you put food on her table. What did you mean by that? Yeah, Nala's up now. Look at her little bun buns. Look at your little bun buns. Look at your little bun buns. So Nala is actually starting to stand up on her own. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. You see her? You see her trying to do this? Look at her. Like she's not standing, but she's like always wanting to like stand up. See? She like pulls herself up. Go ahead, girl. Look at her. So that's something new that she started doing what? It's probably only been like a few days, maybe four or five days. Standing up? Yeah. Yeah. What was I saying? Four or five days a week. Something like that. So, oop. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So that's a new thing. She constantly want to get up. And now she figured this out. And now she's just growing. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at you. Look at you, girl. Look at you, girl. It's like, where did the time go? So, uh-oh. You got to do the uh-oh thing so they don't want to cry when they fall. Y'all see kind of where our house is going? Look at our little decor. So this is why I feel like we can never get nothing done. Cause by the time Nala gets home, she's worn out, but she want to play a little bit more. Then she want to eat and then it's time for bed. Like what time is it? It's already seven o'clock and she go to bed at eight every day, every day, except for yesterday. So yeah, that's why we can never get nothing done child because 
we have this girl who is growing up and becoming really, 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 really big. I just started really cleaning up that room. <sighs> that room still has a long way to go. I don't know what to expect. We got four days, three days technically, until the shower. Ow! You scratched me in my neck. Ow! She be beating me up. Child. Child. Why are you trying to climb over me? What am I going to do when her sister come? <laughs> what? <coughs> uh, we'll ask for it. She see her bottle behind me. Oh, Nala, Nala. She hold her bottle good now. Y'all see this? I don't know if I updated you guys on her bottle situation, but she pretty much got a damn pet now. Only thing is, is that she doesn't really sleep if she holds her bottle in the middle of the night or when putting her to sleep, but I hear that's very common that a lot of babies don't like to hold their own bottle or they don't sleep if they hold their own bottle. So she's just normal child. But she finally got it. I think she got it around nine months, eight months. I don't know how long it's been, child. But if it's really full, she struggles a little bit. But overall, she does fine. But these are like baby size bottles. So I'm interested in seeing how she do, does when she get bigger bottles. So right now, she's still drinking roughly about five ounces, close to six. Oh, another update is hopefully she can get out of daycare really soon. I am crossing my fingers on it. David is living day to day by it. But we wasn't originally supposed to be taking her out of daycare anytime soon because we were supposed to be help adjusting for me delivering new baby but i gave an idea out to daddy david and now he want her out i don't know why i suggested this because what i'm gonna do how i'm gonna function and get life together and take care of her and myself you can do it shut up you ain't gonna be here it. So it's gonna be very stressful this next month and a half because I'm gonna have to deal with her all day and baby is getting a little big I say little I don't think uh, you think I'm small babe She's not big well thank you for that clarification yeah you know you're not big but you weren't big with Nala either I did get big though. That's like the last month. I don't think I think I was bigger with Nala, but I still don't think even with Nala I was big. But yeah, I don't know why I suggested this because now I'm gonna have to deal with this this baby who can't sit still, who stresses him out, and he ain't even pregnant, nor is he dealing with hormonal issues, and he want me to take her on. Eight months pregnant. Super wide, you can do it. Shut up. Hopefully if you like go out, like go to the grocery store or something, try to meet like other moms. Get a mom crew. First of all, I ain't meet nobody no at all during Nala's. <laughs> you know, I went to TJ Maxx today. There's women in there with other babies, with their babies, and all kind of like, nobody worked around here. This is a town full of housewives. <laughs> I need a check. So that's where you got you gotta go teach it, man. I need a check. Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> hmm? I need a check. I need an allowance. Allowance? Yeah. Allowance. Nala, what is you doing? Nala, leave that cover alone. <laughs> Nala. Leave the color alo cover alone. Look at her. What I'm gonna do? She gonna be walking about time I'm home. Yeah. This is what I'm dealing with. Look, girl, stop for you create an avalanche. This is what I gotta deal with. 
Now look, and now you stuck. Look at you. Now you stuck. Anyway, you know what he looking forward to? Let me zoom in on his face when I say this. He only care about the money he's saving. He, he don't care about me. He don't care about me or the concerns or anything I would be putting myself into. The money we save. I don't care if you say we. I so bad want to give her her toy already. Nope, gotta wait. I so bad want to get her toy already. Nope, gotta wait. I just want to open it. <laughs> All right, so we gonna go ahead and head out because we just creating minutes for no reason. So, ooh, who got slapped just then? Hey, I missed it. Rewind it. Alright, so we out. I'll see you in the next clip part tomorrow. In the next one.